Uh, it's worth talking about because remember earlier this week, of course, we got the news that Arconic said, no, we're done. We're not talking to you anymore, Apollo. Surprising everybody. Uh, 2220 was the number, according to reporting from some others uh, out there. There were some minor, seemingly minor issues, whether it be pension costs or whether they were going to pay the dividend during the period of uh, uh, before the deal would close. But the board of Arconic walked away. And since then, you've had a lot of stock change hands, and you've had any number of investors trying to pressure, as you might expect would be the case, the board and management of Arconic to reconsider uh, and hope that they will re-engage with Apollo, saying, come on, 2220 was right there. Uh, yes, it got emotional. Yes, Apollo can be very difficult to deal with in certain ways, and there does appear to have been a lack of trust, perhaps, on the part of the board that was uh, finally just simply too much for them. Uh, and the reason that they said no. Um, Elliott figures into this because they own more than 10%. They do have three board members. Uh, but I will tell you one thing here, which I'm hearing a lot about, which does not appear to at least be the case at this moment, which is while there is pressure certainly being applied in the hopes that there will be some re-engagement, very much unclear whether that's going to really take place, there is not a plan, from what I hear at least from people who are uh, familiar with the situation, that Elliott would consider a proxy fight. Uh, the nomination window is open. I think it's until the middle of February. Uh, but at this point, that is not where the focus at Elliott, significant holder here, of course, uh, is they are simply focused much more so on can we get these guys to re-engage yeah. given how close they were, inches away from getting the deal done but wow. not necessarily on a proxy fight, which would be problematic for any number of reasons uh, from the Elliott perspective at this point. So did want to share that on Arconic, which really was stunning in terms of the turnabout there earlier this week. Yeah, that, that's a good board. It's a decent board. Uh, you know, look, I mean, you know, Klaus said this up, Chip Blankets is a heavyweight. Uh, the fellow that is from uh, this David Miller from Elliott's a heavyweight. So I think it's a, I think it's a not done story. Well, we'll see. Yeah. We'll see. But don't expect anything in terms of Elliott, at least at this point, okay. initiating a proxy fight.